Hi, I'm Scott with Michigan Pool News, an aquatic source. We're at a state-of-the-art project in West Bloomfield School Districts. They've slowly been renovating this equipment room over time to bring it up with state-of-the-art equipment. Um, and this happens to be one of them. This is a drive. Um, you can get various models of these drives. Uh, you can get um, a green drive. You can get an AccuDrive. This one happens to be an H2 Flow. Um, one, of the, one of the things with the drive, they put this in earlier on in the project when they had um, high-rate sand media and they've went over to regenerative media filtration here, which we're gonna have another video tagged to it talking about the filter at this project. And um, at that point, the high rate sand was running at 90% with the drive. Now we've went to regenerative, it's 78, which is, you know, 12%, but 12%, I can tell you, adds up to a lot. We can look right in this, and this is kind of nice on this drive in particular, you pay a lot of extra cash to get this controller, but it makes sense if you're convincing people of what's going on here. Um, it has an energy button. It shows that this has ran for 22,000 hours, um, so it's running basically every day, every hour, it runs all the time. It saved 23,000, almost 24,000 kilowatt hours and has saved the district $16,352 since the inception of the drive that was installed. I, I can make sure we get that date to you and let you know, but I can't say enough about drives. You can't have a state of an art project without having one, but you do need to get an audit to make sure it fits your facility. That's all I can say about that for Michigan Pool News.